Hi guys, Matt from 123MyIT here and welcome to the channel. In this video, we will show you how to transfer WhatsApp data from your Android phone to iPhone. Until recently, transferring WhatsApp chats, media and data from Android to iPhone was almost impossible. But now there is an official way to transfer all your WhatsApp chats and media from Android to iPhone. To do this, you will need to make sure that both your Android and iPhone are fully up to date. So go into settings and make sure there are no updates pending. You will need the Move to iOS app installed on your Android phone. Don't worry, I will show you how to get that from the Google Play Store. You will need to use the same phone number, so you can't be changing phone numbers and expect it to still work. It won't work that way. You will need to do a factory reset of your iPhone, so just make sure you have a backup if you need to. And the last thing that you will need is to make sure that both devices are fully charged and connected to the same Wi-Fi. Find the Google Play icon and download the Move to iOS app on your Android phone. Agree to the terms, tap Don't Send on app usage, and then turn the device location on if required. So tap on Settings and turn it on via the toggle button. You can see the Move to iOS app down the bottom. Tap back and that should put you back into the Move to iOS screen. Once you get to the Find Your Code screen, go to the iPhone and do a factory reset. This can be done under Settings, General, and Transfer or Reset iPhone. This will wipe any data you have on your iPhone, so make sure you do a backup first. Cool. So once your iPhone has reset itself, swipe up and select your language, country, and join the iPhone to the same Wi-Fi as your Android phone. Tap continue on the data and privacy screen and I will set up face unlock later. You can set that up now if you want to. And I will also go ahead and set up a passcode. Great, so you made it to the apps and data screen. Tap on the move data from Android button and then tap continue on the next screen and then type in the code on your Android device. Now on your Android phone, select any data that you want to copy across to your iPhone. What we are after is if you scroll down, you will now see a WhatsApp button. All right, thumbs up, we're almost there. Tap on start and it will get your chats ready to transfer. Once it's done, tap on Next, and that will take you back to the Move iOS app. Tap on Continue, and your WhatsApp chats will start to transfer across. Awesome, you have now moved your WhatsApp across from your Android phone to your iPhone. Tap done on your Android and continue setting up your iPhone how you want it. Enter your Apple ID and if you have two-factor authentication turned on, enter your code. If you have a SIM, you can move it from your Android phone to your iPhone now. If you have an eSIM, you can tap on transfer from nearby iPhone or use a QR code. If you get stuck, check with your service provider. I've got a SIM card, so I would just manually transfer that across.
As part of the setup process, you will get more prompts to transfer apps and again to transfer the eSIM. So do that if you need to. If you swipe across, you should see your WhatsApp icon. Tap on that to download it from the App Store if you need to. While that's downloading, I'm going to transfer my SIM card. Just remember you need the number, the same phone number, to be able to get your WhatsApp chats working on your new phone. Tap on agree and continue and enter in your cell or your mobile phone number. Once you confirm your number, WhatsApp will send you a code to enter. Find your SMS code and then enter it here. On the Move Chats from Android screen, tap Start and give WhatsApp the permissions it needs. Tap Next and enter in your name. I just use the wolf emoji. Awesome, so all your WhatsApp chats and media should be transferred across now. So go through them and check them and make sure they are all there. Guys, I hope this was a helpful video and you got something out of it. Please don't forget to check out my other videos such as transfer everything iPhone to new iPhone 14. And do me a favor, if you know anyone who might like this video, please share it with them. Hit the subscribe button and smash that bell icon.